getting started in fly fishing, a um, great place to learn is at your local lake or pond. Um, you can practice casting, and there are tons of panfish that are ready and willing to eat. Uh, today we stood on the end of the dock here and caught countless bluegill and panfish. Uh, it's, it's real easy to get into the sport when you're catching fish nonstop. It, it takes a lot of the uh, frustration away. When you're fishing in a lake like this, um, if you have a nice open area, it's uh, easy to practice your casting. If you can wait out a little ways and just practice your casting, that's perfect place to get your line wet and fine tune your casting. Um, plus there's lots of fish out there. The other thing that you can practice when you're out on a lake like this or on the end of your dock is setting the hook on the fish. Uh, practicing timing, uh, you can, it's visual, you know, you're, you can see the fish come up and take. Today we were using a little flying ant. Um, typical flying ant pattern, twitch it on the water, the bluegill love it. And it's, it's a great, great way to get started, especially for little kids. If you want to get kids started in fly fishing, definitely get them into some panfish. Um, we get a lot of uh, people that come into our store that have never fly fished before. And right off the bat, we can tell that uh, they're a little intimidated, nervous, you know, don't know what to ask. Um, any fly shop you walk into, anyone that works there is going to be more than willing to share their knowledge to help you. Um, you know, we, we tell anyone that comes in that gets started, you know, you, you're going to want a five or a six weight, uh, which is a typical, um, typical rod that you would start out with. I started out with a six weight. Um, we tend to recommend the five or six weight because it's not a slow action or a whippy rod and it's not a real stiff rod like a lot of the heavier rods will be. You're going to be able to learn your casting a lot easier on it and you're going to be able to catch a wide variety of fish on it, whether it's the panfish, trout, bass, um, you name it, you can catch a fish and land it on a six weight, minus the big game species like steelhead, salmon, muskie. Um, price wise, a lot of people stray away from fly fishing because they assume it's a rich man sport. Um, it can be, but it doesn't have to be. You can get fully set up out on the water for 150 to 200 dollars and most of those are going to come with some sort of manufacturer's guarantee or warranty. Um, so if you break it on a fish or in your car door, depending on the manufacturer, send it back with a uh, handling fee, which is typically $25 to $30, $35, you get a brand new rod.